Hello, we're on to the final group now for this alphabetical World Cup series. So we've got the likes of Germany, Haiti, Belgium, Denmark, and England all competing. And we're looking for the top two to go to the grand finale. So it doesn't matter too much if you end up winning or coming second, but it is on the issue come in those top two placings. So how do these nations manage to reach the stage, you may ask? Well, let's give a brief recap in case you have missed it. So Germany, they managed to top the G country qualification with 13 wins, 2 defeats, 39 points. They were 3 points ahead of the lights of Ghana and behind them Guinea and Guatemala. Uh, for Haiti there, they topped their group of 5 nations with 3 wins, 1 draw, no defeats and 10 points. Defeating the lights of Hungary, Honduras... Hong Kong and Hitra. For Belgium, number one in the world, it's going to be tough to stop them. They are the favourites for a reason. Uh, they managed to top with 12 wins, 2 draws, 1 defeat, 38 points. Though Brazil were only 1 point behind them and they went undefeated, but too many draws cost them their place. And for Denmark, they topped the group three points ahead of the Democratic Republic of Congo with a perfect seven out of seven wins. 59 goals scored, just the one conceded. Djibouti, Dominican Republic, Dominica, Dalvakirk, Don de Gisk, and Darfur, other challenges. For England, they went undefeated. Nine wins, one draw, and no defeats. 28 points in the mitts. Comfortable six points ahead of Ecuador. Egypt, Ecuador, Guinea, and other challenges. And in the second stage competition, Germany went on and defeated the likes of Portugal, Netherlands, Japan, and Kenya. It came down to goal difference between them and Portugal. And just by the one there, they managed to sneak on through. For Haiti, they got a bit lucky with their draw there because it was winning the drawn with the different countries going to different groups sections. So they went undefeated, two wins and two draws, eight points. Defeating the likes of Qatar, Ukraine, underperforming, Vietnam and Yemen. For Belgium, they had three wins, one defeat, nine points. Defeating the likes of Austria, Colombia, Libya and Madagascar. And for Denmark there, four wins out of four. 9 goals scored, 3 against, 12 points, ahead of the likes of Russia, Turkey, Zambia and Iceland. And for England, in that absolute dramatic group in the last video there, both them, Spain and France, all had 3 wins, but they all lost the game, and it came down to goal difference, plus 6 to plus 5 to plus 4, and England just narrowly managing to squeak it and get into this special final stage group so who's going to make the top two let's go out and see so you can see the favorites are probably going to be like the likes of germany belgium and england but you know can denmark sneak on there or can haiti cause a big surprise let's go out and find out so it's a group tournament neutral venue and one match against every different nation so there'll be four games each in total so let's go ahead and simulate these results. Right, kick off and zoom out. Hit the hits and then zoom in. So we got Germany 4 2 winners against Haiti to kick things off. Belgium 3 0 winners against Denmark. Germany and England drew 1 1. Haiti and Belgium 0 0 draw. Denmark and England 0 0 draw. Belgium 2 0 against Germany. Denmark sneaking past Haiti 2-1. Belgium and England join 2-2. So quite a few draws in here. Just shows you how tough this final group and tournament format is going to be. Germany 3-1 against Denmark and England 4-0 against Haiti. So if that all said and done, who are our top two nations? Well, number one spot is the number one world weight country in the world. And that is Belgium there. Two wins, two draws. No defeats and 8 points. Germany in 2nd spot. So 2 wins, 1 draw, 1 defeat and 7 points. 
England, they come in third, so it's not going to be back-to-back Belgium-England final matches in my football simulator World Cup sort of uh, World Cup that was previously. This is the alphabetical World Cup, so a little bit different, but they went undefeated actually. 1-1, one, one, three draws, too many draws cost them six points. Denmark in four spots, one win, one draw, two defeats, and four points. And at the bottom there is Haiti in fifth. Zero wins, one draw, and three defeats, and one point. So congratulations to Belgium and Germany, who end up making it into the final. And well done to everyone else for participating. It takes some work for these nations to go on and get to the stage there, so... We'll just have to see what you do in the future video series. So get commenting on what you want to see after this is all said and done. But hopefully you enjoyed the series so far. If you do, hit the like button. If you're new to the channel, feel free to subscribe and comment below who do you think is going to win the final. Is it going to be Belgium or is it going to be Germany? Cheers.